Hey everyone, this is Jerry here at Butler Family Farms and come out here to show you what Susan and Robert did today. Uh, they were pulling weeds and I said to them, they're actually pulling Johnson grass and I said to them, why are you guys pulling Johnson grass? Why don't you just get the torch out and just start burning it off? Well, I should have probably stood out here, but I didn't. And Robert started to burn off the uh, Johnson grass, but this is what he ended up happening. As you can see, it uh, got away from him. And what happened was he started right there to burning. Instead of burning at the far end and working his way back, he started upwind and the wind got it. And the wind took off and burned over there and burned inside there and burned along here and got Susan's pallets and melted one of her, two of her tubs. This is one of the tubs that got a little, a little soft. And I was in the house watching Jesse and Lisa on their, uh, their live. And I went, boy, I, I smell smoke. And it shouldn't have been that much smoke because he's just burning a little bit of weeds and I thought he would start over there and work his way out so the flames would be going out as he's putting them as he's burning it well I walk around the corner and Susan's running around with getting buckets out of the goat water which is over there the temporary water in the corner she's running around getting buckets out bringing water to Lee he's throwing a Robert and he's throwing water on the on the places that are burning and there are some pretty good sized flames and this is an old, uh, some old straw right there that was glowing, glowing red. <laughs> and he's throwing water on it and she's running back and forth over there getting a bucket. And he's got this thing over oh, here all, all on flames and shooting up. And you see the flames, how they melted the cords here. And this right here had something on it that is just got fried. And uh, we had... <laughs> I don't know. I walk around and I said, what are you guys doing? And of course, they, you know, they're both not been, not been used to doing fires like I have been. They both kind of, not panicking, but Susan was running with the thing and Lee was mad because it got away from him. Anyways, this is going to be the opening of our uh, seed collaboration with the Vineyard Chicks. And we're going to go in and open the seeds that we got. And that's going to be part of our opening. But this is where we're going to do our seeds when, after the smell gets out of here, we'll clean up the uh, area. We're going to put our seeds out in this area. Anyway, thanks for, thanks for watching. Okay, so Susan's going to open the package we got from the Vineyard Chicks. It's an envelope. The envelope, sorry. Envelope. With it's supposed to have our seeds in it for our opening video. Of their Survivor... Seed Survivor Collaboration, right? Survivor Seed Collaboration 2024. Right. It's being done by the Vineyard Chicks Homestead. Bushcraft Family is doing an urban tincture uh, collaboration which is, at the same which time. Which is, uh, it's the uh, seasoning pa uh, seeds that they're giving away. Herbs. Herb, herbs, herbs, that's the herb yeah. seeds. And, and t herbs for seasonings and uh, tinctures, me right. me medicinal. And then Lazy Days Ahead with Jesse and Lisa is uh, part of the collaboration as the giveaway. And this is an all year... Collaboration. Collaboration. Actually, it's a gardening collaboration, but right. it's um, uh, yeah, going all year. We're doing our entry. This is our entry video with our seeds that um, is a marinara tomato. All right. Um, we've got uh, Italian pepperoncinis. Oops. Okay. Um, we've got Gemini. Uh, light red kidney beans, chili beans. Um, we've got uh, Detroit red beets and uh, Walla Walla onions, and then uh, Wal Waltham butternut squash. 
And the girls. So how many packages is that? It's, not, it's uh, that six, six or seven. It's six. Okay. And the girls have done an excellent job on promoting this collaboration. There's a little verbiage about each one of the packet of seeds, as well as uh, their labeling, um, the type, the variety, the date collected, and growing notes on the back of each packet. And nice. So our last frost uh, for Southwest Missouri, and we are now in uh, Zone 7. Uh, we were in Zone 6B, but USDA has changed the hardiness map. And we are in Zone 7. So our freeze date, according to the Farmer's Almanac, is um, April 17th. So the first part of March, another couple weeks, we're going to start our... Uh, well, we kind of started the day cleaning up the, the garden. Or you started, you and Robert started the day cleaning up the garden, and it got carried it, away. Got a little, out a little hand. hot out there. Well, <laughs> that 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 part, we got that. There's a little bit more cleaning to do. But what I was trying to say was that we we're going to uh, start our seeds right um, in house uh, the first week and week or two of March, so that that gives them about six weeks to get hardy in the house to go outside. And we'll probably plant them after, in between, April's a very busy month, but in between, um, I guess, ten before 10 killer, the 10 killer meetup, we'll do it then. Okay. So, anyway. So these, this is our opening video. This was the first I did the part outside. Right. And we will uh, get these started, and we'll do another little clip or two together uh, when we get them planted, and then we will watch their progress and then figure out how we're going to do our preservation of them. So thank you Vineyard Chicks for letting us be a part of this and uh, looking forward to a fun garden season. Okay everybody, if you haven't subscribed to the, the channels like uh, Vineyard Chicks or Lazy Days Ahead, what was the other one called? Bush, Bushcraft Family. Bushcraft Family. Go ahead and be sure to subscribe to them. It's still, you can still email them if you want and get in and for the uh, collaboration, they said there's so yeah, you know, they still have some seeds to go, but uh, this is going to be our video, our opening video, and I'm going to get this edited and get it posted so it's ready for the giveaway that they're going to do on Sunday, the first one. So Jesse is also doing a giveaway. I guess every month he's going to do one giveaway. So thank you very much for for watching, and we appreciate it. Yeah.